Hey G Squad, welcome back to episode of Is It Worth It? So today's episode at this cool, amazing product right here in my hand and basically what this is, is a solar charger that also works as a power bank to charge multiple devices at the same time. And you can see right here, it tells you guys some of the features that's on the product itself. You can see right there. So I mentioned how it has wireless charging, it has solar charging, it's waterproof, and you guys can definitely use it outdoor as well. So for the one that we got right here, it's a total of 30,000 mAh, which is definitely a lot of power. But first thing first, I'm actually open the product to show you guys what's included inside first before I actually test it out. All right, so when you guys first open it up, you guys can see that that is what looks like inside here. Let's take it out. So inside, they do provide guys a user manual to teach you guys how to use the product itself. And then right here, they do provide you guys a cable. So the cable that's provided for you guys right here is a USB to USB-C cable. So that way you can get the fastest charging option on here. And then right here, we have the actual power bank right here. Let's take it out. All right, so if you view the actual product itself right here, it definitely has a little bit of a weight to it, but it's not like super heavy. Let me take it out. So this is basically what the product looks right here. You can see it definitely looks pretty awesome and really high quality. So this part right here is the wireless charging option right here. And then see right here, they also have a built-in compass. So definitely use that to find your direction if you guys ever get lost. If we turn it to the other side, this is basically the solar charging option. And if you guys notice once I turned it around, you can see a light pops on right here. So once I let go of my hand, the light comes back on. But once I put my hand right here, the light is gone. And that light is basically an indicator light to show you guys when the solar charging option is working. So if I take a look right here and right here and the other side as well, you definitely can see that protection layer right here. So if you guys do end up dropping it, it definitely has that shot impact right here. And if you take a look on this side right here, it's fully covered. But basically what's on here is the actual charging output here. So if you guys open up right here, you guys can see that as well as like inside right here. So it definitely has two USB outputs right here. It has a USB-C and a micro USB option right here. So you definitely have the option to use all of that if you guys want to use the option right here. And once you guys are done, you guys can close it back up like this to seal it back up. Then the actual product itself is water resistant and waterproof as well. If you turn on this side right here, you can definitely see that it has a built-in flashlight option, which is super awesome. So that way, when you guys are using this at nighttime, you definitely can use it as a flashlight to see where you guys are going. So you see right here, they have this slot where you can actually put on like a keychain or lanyard on here. You guys want to use that option. And then right here, they have the button to activate the product itself. So once you press it one time, you can see the light pops on right here. So that's basically the indicator light right here to show you guys when the product itself is working. And this indicator light also shows you guys the battery life on here as well. But that is basically everything that's on the product itself. Let's actually activate this and test it out in terms of flashlight and also the charging output to see when not all of that works. So first thing I want to test is probably the flashlight option. So you guys want to press and hold down the button right here. All right, so it turns on. And definitely see that it's really bright. So if I shine the light right there, you can definitely see how bright the light is. So for the flashlight option, there's only one mode. So if you guys want to turn it off, you just have to press and hold it down. And it turns off. So there's no like SOS mode or any other light mode besides the mode that has actually turned on the actual product itself. Now let's test out the wireless charging option here to see what it actually works. All right, so I got my phone right here. If I just go like this, all right. So you can definitely see that actually does work using the wireless charger option. But now let's plug in the cable and try those out. So we're going to open this up. And I'll plug in the USB cables first. So I'll plug in this one first. And this is my USB to micro USB cable. So I'll plug this to charge my Bose headphone right here. All right, so that worked. So it's charging my Bose headphone right there. Now I'm gonna actually plug in the next one. So for the next one, I'm gonna plug it in right here for the other USB option here. And we'll plug this to my fan that I have right here in the back. So you can see the indicator right there to show you guys that that is charging as well. So it is charging my headphone and charging my fan here. Let me actually use my phone to do the wireless charging to see when it actually works. All right, so that works as well. So you can definitely charge three devices at the same time if I use both the USB cables here and also the actual wireless charging option here. So let me actually unplug these two cables and try it on another device. So I do have another power bank right here. So I'm gonna use a power bank to charge this power bank and see when it actually works. All right. So we have the micro USB cable right here, plug it in, and I'll unplug the other side to my power bank right here. So once we have the cable plugged in here from my other power bank, you can definitely see that it is charged in the product itself. So that definitely does work. Now I'm gonna actually plug in the other side, which is the USB, to see whether or not we can actually charge another device while charging the power bank. All right, so I use the same cable right here. All right, so you can see right here, it is charging this device right here, which is my fan. So you can definitely charge another device while charging the actual power bank itself. And you should be able to also use the wireless charging as well. So let me actually test that out. Let's try it. All right, so you can definitely see that actually does work. I believe the same thing should happen if you actually use a USB-C cable. All right, so I have the USB-C cable here. We have it plugged in. I want to plug this into my outer power bank. All right, so once we have it plugged in, you can see that it is charging the power bank right here. And I plug this cable right here. 
onto right here. And now I'll unplug this other side right here. You guys can see the actually charging the device as well. And we're actually plugging the cable right here. You can actually see that actually plugs in two cables side by side. So that's actually quite surprising because I thought you guys could not actually fit the cable on here. So since I actually can fit the cable on here, let me actually plug these two as well and see whether or not we can actually fit more cables on here. All right, so we got another cable plugged in right here. So this one, two, three cables now. Let's try it out. I'm gonna plug it into my bone conduction headphone right here. All right. So you can see that it's actually charging parts up right there. So you can definitely charge three devices at the same time and the other two is charge other devices. And we try the wireless charging again. All right. So you can definitely see that it actually does work to charge three devices at the same time while actually charging the power bank as well. All right, so as you see from the actual test itself, it actually works pretty well. You can definitely charge multiple devices at the same time. Now I'm actually do a quick waterproof test to see whether or not it's actually waterproof, and then we'll come back and talk more about the product in a second. All right, so we got the water right here. I got my power bank right here. So I just wanna make sure it's fully sealed first. And yeah, I'm turning on the light. All right, so I have the light on, and this part is sealed. Let's dump it in. All right, so you can see the product itself is fully waterproof. When we dump it in, none of the water is actually getting in, which is super nice. And the light is still working. So the product itself is definitely waterproof or water resistant. But obviously it's not advised for you guys to actually do this. If you guys get like splashes here and there for like rain or whatever, it's definitely fine. But definitely not advised for you guys to actually throw it into like a water or like an ocean or whatever. All right, welcome back guys. So now you guys saw the quick test of product itself, you can definitely see that it is waterproof and everything works pretty well. So it's definitely super cool and super convenient, especially if you guys plan on using this for like camping or going on travels or whatever. These are super convenient to have. But now that we could unboxing and test the product itself, now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth or not. So for me, honestly, I definitely have to say that any kind of power bank in general where it has everything that's built on the actual product itself like this one, such as the flashlight, the wireless charging, the fact that the actual product itself is waterproof or water resistant, and the fact that it's actually charged multiple devices at the same time, then I would definitely have to say that it is worth it. <laughs> but then obviously for those guys who don't want or don't need one or have one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that you do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.